Look at my like feet imprint. That is actually kind of funny to me. I have to wear this on the beach. It looks like one of those like applesauce to go pouches that you eat. <laughs> this honestly i'm ready to go hawaii guys hey guys um we're pulling out the base bag luggage set because today i am packing super late to my hawaii trip and i know y'all are probably like why would you do this yourself literally i don't know i am on a time crunch and we leave at 5 a.m in the morning this week so uh what better way than to stress myself out and also film and edit this video while we're at it I'm gonna be in Hawaii for about five days, so not too long, but also not like super short. I think we can fit everything in this backpack and also my carry-on set. So let's get straight into it. I literally do not put on any makeup today because I just feel like I'm in a rush, <laughs> clearly. And I still have to go to the gym because there ain't gonna be no gym at the place we're staying at. My room is an absolute mess, but I think I'm gonna figure that out maybe if I have time today or when I come back. Maybe that's, that's probably the answer, when I come back. Right now, I am trying to figure out all the stuff that I will be wearing and luckily for me i did plan out like on my notions list um like certain outfit ideas as well as accessories and like hair products i do need to bring first things first let's do outfits or whatnot, skirts, kind of like cover-ups. Something that's actually more comfortable because it's gonna be really sticky and I don't know about that, so. Skim stress. This makes me look snap a freaking up. With me, I'll probably bring six outfits just so I can like rewear, mismatch or whatever on certain occasions. I waited so long to go to a tropical place, y'all. Look at the crochet. I also bought another thing that's crochet, um, like a skirt and like a bathing suit top too that matched with it, but I have to wear this on the beach. These photos are gonna slay, just so you know. I know I've worn this in like two of my pictures so far on Instagram, but this corset is everything. It's not sponsored in any way, although I wish. Um, guys. That did not just happen. That was the perfect angle, but that fall was like horrendous. Oh my gosh. Look how adorable. I I'll probably jump in the pool, maybe like twice, but it's all for the pics, all for tanning. The matching bottoms to it, it looks very tropical in my opinion. Uh, I'm gonna be around my family, but honestly, I think this covers up most of my butt anyway, so. So this is my top. So let's say I wore that bikini, we're gonna go in town. I'm just gonna like literally put this on top and it has the cutest ever, like back to it. And obviously you can tie it so it can be tighter. This is a size extra small. So I have that and then obviously I could just wear this skirt. It's a very, very long skirt and guys, I am just, I'm excited. That was the only thing I bought for this trip because homegirl's on a budget. Usually I like to like shop for the trip versus like being on the trip, if that makes sense. So that was what I was, yeah, just literally four items. And that was over $200 and I almost killed myself. The perfect neon orange cover up from Aritzia. Okay, I know this is kind of extreme, but I think I'm gonna bring a new swimsuit each day. Usually I would rewear some of them, but I just honestly can't choose and I love all of it and they have not been on my feet. Look how cute this bathing suit is. I love like floral lately with the little cute tiny bows. Just love it. And these are so comfortable too. I think I got these from Kittany, which is a really good clothing brand, swimwear brand or whatever. And then black bow is obviously one of the other ones that I love as well. It's also kind of like a picnic -y. Sir! I'm filming a YouTube video, sir. Hey, listen to me, little dog. I'm li literally in the middle of doing something right now and you're, little dog. 
I love cheeky, by the way. This is all what I'm gonna wear. I don't like granny panties because it makes me have a fat grandma tan line. And for me, not flattering on my skin. Maybe for other people, it looks hot shit, but for me, it's just like, I just can't do it. I haven't worn this one in a long time, but this was on my feed one time, but this is um, a triangle bathing suit that I got like probably over like four years ago, but it's in good quality condition. I got this on Shein. I wore this to Hawaii one time, and this is honestly iconic. I need to post this. This is kind of skimpy. I did, it's kind of skinnier than what I would expect. Um, and one time I wore it in front of my parents. My parents were like laughing at me. Okay, so I packed my blowout brush. Kind of just wedged it in there as well as my curler because I always need both of these, especially when I shower and I want to blow out look and then also my waves. All of my sleeping clothes and all of my skirts um, going out wear. This is more of like a sweater, a light sweater, and then kind of like a oversized long sleeve right here as well as um, my bright neon orange one just so I could put it over like my bathing suits if I need to. My socks and as well as my actual bathing suits is in here. Don't call me crazy, but I actually always bring three pairs of shoes no matter where I go because I want one where I can work for dinners, um, walk around um, to the beach and whatnot. So I had this shoe, it's Steve Madden. Had this for literally over four years, like I said. And then I have my Tory Burch sandals that I can just wear to go to the beach. It's all beat up. And look at my like feet in print. <clears throat> that is actually kind of funny to me, but um, they're not totally wrecked. So I'm still gonna like pack those and wear those. Let's pack the backpack. Oh my gosh. I gotta show you what bag I'm bringing. It's not gonna be designer. Stay tuned because look, I'm gonna be using this and I'm gonna teach you how. So I'm gonna bring my neon orange cause bag and it's super puffy. I did a review on this. Um, right now I only have like my sunglasses, gentle monsters, as well as probably will put my ID in here and my little lip oil. I do need to put more on because I look like a dead zombie right now talking to you guys and it's disappearing. There you go. Okay, we are beauty. You're killing it. What's so cool is that like, honestly, I don't wanna have to carry like everything like with me. So I'm just gonna like easily just do this. We can take this out and I can easily just like hang it on like this and just clip it on. So now that we have this all set up, backpack time. Backpack time is always the most stressful just because I have so much stuff to put in here. I'm definitely gonna put my laptop in here on the side right here, as you can tell in the back. But I'm using my laptop until literally once I leave. Because I have a week back, we can just slide this in the back. This little slit, pocket, base. First things first. I always have my makeup or like my um, washing face headband. I put that in the back. I also did pack and bring um, a face mask because on the airplane, my face gets so dry. And so I like to use that afterwards. I have extra face masks just in case for the airplane because I don't like breathing people's coughs and like secondhand burps and stuff like that. So um, surprisingly, okay. And people fart on the plane all the time. So I'm so sorry to gross you out, but that's just, that's the reality. Okay, we need to bring some makeup. I actually will only wear makeup once or twice. And then like for photos, something like that. And then everything else, like it's literally just like natural because the humidity over there is great and the heat, and it's like no point into wearing makeup. Our makeup wipes. Say glowy super gel. Okay, so far we have a lot of room. So um base actually has like one slip pocket here, one big pocket, and I like to put my feminine products here. Okay, so right now I'm actually like putting my skincare routine all bottled up together. I have these to-go pouches that I got from Timu, which is actually kind of funny, but they're really cute and they're very thin. I am putting my hyaluronic, it's kind of like a hair cream serum thing to reduce frizz. Um, obviously there's a lot of humidity. I'm gonna definitely eat this after I shower and then like I'm gonna go out for dinner or something. I also put sunscreen, super goop, in here too and this is a really good investment because like you could throw these out if you wanted to so you could just reuse it it looks like one of those like applesauce to go pouches that you eat i have a lot of stuff i have my gua sha in there as well as my cleanser and my everything okay so other than my toothbrush because i gotta put that last i'm gonna put my skincare pouch just in there like that do want to bring my sour strips because i do get hungry and i like to snack i have to put my laptop in here last i just have to work tonight and then um, my chargers always carry around some type of hand sanitizer this one is so cute it smells like green apple and it hydrates my skin so well compared to the other ones great now it is time to 
put my bag to use. So I already put my um, lip products in here. This, I do need it ASAP today, so I'm gonna have to put that in this bag right here. I don't have a camera um, case, so I'm just gonna use my Chanel dust bag, which is funny, but I honestly need something to put it in. I will be like taking a lot of pictures with that. Camera charger. Apparently the Canon G7X is horrible when it comes to actually charging. Um, it takes like all day or something. Eucerin lotion, you guys, this is my holy grail for eczema and dry skin and relief. I'm ready to go to Hawaii, guys. I honestly think that I'm done packing everything, surprisingly, and I actually did it super fast. So I only just take this and a bag with me like that. And that's basically how I pack to go on any vacation. I've made so many types of videos and I guess you guys are loving these packing videos, but I'm so excited. And by the time that you watch this, I will probably be back to tell you more about how my trip went. If you guys do like this, please don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below, and don't forget to turn that post notification. That way you don't want to post the entire week and we'll definitely see you guys in the next YouTube. But I uh, she really wanna, but can't stand to see me walk out the door.